Hi Dresser Cuties, Wendy here. Today we're going to draw Luca from Disney's Luca. So let's get started. To draw this cute sea monster boy, let's first type our draw on his face. So I'm going to come right here and draw basically the bottom of a U. So let's come right here. Nice and round. I'm going to come right across. About right here. And connect at the bottom with a big curve towards my center and then back up. There, nice round curve. Then we're going to come back to where we started on the edge right here. I'm going to draw a big circle. And let's come right across and do the same thing about right here. And so now that we have our circles in, let's come in here with two small circles for highlights. And a curved line at the bottom. And shape in the top. And lines at the bottom and same thing over here. So I've watched this movie and it's like the cutest movie ever. Simple story but very very cute. So I just really wanted to draw this for you and um, definitely check out my cat from the movie that I really adored and I thought it was the highlight of the movie. <laughs> There, now that we have the eyes in, let's come to the edge right here. I'm going to draw a soft curve right here, just to anchor my eyes. I come down with a curve right there. And let's give Luca here a sweet smile. So about right here, I'm just going to bring up a big curve that slightly goes upwards and cap it off. Then let's draw his brow. So I'm going to come straight up about right here and draw a soft curve that slightly comes downwards. I'm going to thicken it up and down. So same thing over here. So about right here, come slightly downwards and thicken it up. There. I think they're brown, so I'm not going to shade them in black. So then now let's go, um, let's bring this up a tiny bit more and we're going to come in more with our curve. And then uh, let's go up. So we're going to imagine this as an oval. So say about right here, I'll bring it in for his head. And I'm going to stop. If you're using a pencil, definitely just finish this curve right here. But I'm going to stop about right here on this edge. And I'm going to draw a little curl. I'm going to come out, pop out this little curl, come right back. And I'm going, now I'm going to continue my curve and then bring it down. There. So we framed in his face. From this little curl right here, I'm going to come up and draw this main uh, curl on his head. So I'm just going to bring this curve up. And let's bring this in right here. And then let's go around. So this kind of reminds me of a croissant. <laughs> this big strand right here. So it's going to about right here. So I'm just going to keep going. Let's say about three of them. One and one more. So it kind of looks like a croissant, right? For his hair. <laughs> and then let's come back. And now that I have this main one in, where his eye is about right here. I'm going to come and give myself a point 
and I'll start with the side. So I'm just going to go curve, curve, and we're creating this curve that comes right back to here. So I'm just going to give a three curves and on this corner right here, I'm going to come up a curve right there. And I want to fill in this space. So that's my goal. And I'm just going to come in here and tuck in two curves to fill it up. And let's fill in this space right here. One and then one more. And you can bring this in as a detail. So that's our goal basically, just to fill in this space with all these curves to make his hair look curly. There. And then let's come back in here and we're going to tuck in that ear. These huge ears. And in. And then for some details, I'm just going to bring in a curve right there. So now for the other side. So I'm going to drag this point across so about right here in this area. I'm going to go up once again, same thing. Let me change it up a little bit. And let's see here. About right here, there's just going to be a parting, parting of the hair right here. So in this area right here, let's come down and curl it up. And continue it up. So let's bring this in and tuck it in right here where his hair parts. And then in this space right here, we're just going to fill it once again. So I'm just going to come here, maybe one curve and then another one right there. There. And then once again, these huge ears about right here at the end. inside for his ear. And now we have Luca. <laughs> so cute, right? So I really hope I didn't overcomplicate that part right there and helped you out with the hair. Now that we have that, let's draw his body. So I'm going to give him a little neck right in the center. About right here and here. And let's bring this down a little bit for his neck. And I'm going to come around to draw his collar. To draw a curve that comes around his neck and then let's see here let's connect it with a V and then for his collar let's bring this out and then right here curve and connect so same thing here curve and then right in this area and connect now let's bring in his shoulder. So let's come down by right here and curve down. So same thing over here. Curve down. Now I'm going to imagine his armpit. So say about right here and here. I'll give myself two points. And from there, I'm going to give it a slight curve downwards. Then let's keep bringing this down. And let's see here. Let's bring this curve angle out a little bit and towards the center. We're going to just go straight down for his shirt. And I'll say about right there. I'll stop and I'll bring this in. So curve towards the center. Do a little notch and connect for his shirt. Then let's come straight down once again about right here. I'm going to draw a slight angle line and we're going to start his shorts. So come out with two slight curves. Come back right here. A little angle and then go ahead and connect for his shorts. So same thing on this side. And for some details come in here with a straight line in the center. And let's see, now we can go ahead and draw his feet and legs. So let's come about right here. We're going to pop them out 
in here. Let's give it a slight angle. Come down about right there. I'm going to stop. I'm going to start to flare it out a little bit for his feet. So let's come out with a heel. And come out and curve. One, two, three, and four, and bring it right back <laughs> for his feet. So we're having, the, we're having these curves because we need to put in these little curves for the toes right there. So let's do the same thing on the other side. So a slight angle. Come out and about right here is heel. And once again, come out. And we're going to start to curve. So going in. About right there. One, two, three, four. There. Now that we have his feet done, let's go ahead and work on his arms. So I'm going to bring this up just to finish in the detail right here, curve. And it's come about right here towards the side. It's going to bring this down. And about right there, I'm going to stop and cut it off and then wobble. Where his sleeves are rolled up and connected. And then let's continue his arms down about right there. And then come let all his hands gonna be about in this area. So let's come right here and draw a thumb and his fingers. So then angle this and connect. And then right here, you can just add in a little detail for a line. So if you're using a pencil, you can just go ahead and finish this curve first before you add in this sleeve part. So let's do the same thing on this side. Curve and curve. And once again, put right there, cut it off. Wobble. And connect. And let's go and continue this. And once again, about right there, we're gonna stop and draw his thumb and his fingers. And then a little detail right here, a little, little line there. And then that is pretty much it. I will just draw some uh, details right here, some buttons. And last but not least, I'll add a heart right here to make him my draw so cute, Luca. So they're all done. I really hope you love my version of Luca here and that I made it fun and easy for you to follow along. Thanks so much for watching and if you loved it, please make sure to subscribe and turn on your notification bell so you won't miss any new Jurassic Cube videos. See you 